this verse. Nothing to see here, please. Good morning, everyone. It's not really morning. We've been up for quite a while. Yep. Um, did mess with the chickens. Um, I'm not doing the Grub Terra um, review deal because we're not going to have enough time. We have to take him to the airport. Um, but I wanted to give him more, ju you know, more justice than just oh, look what they sent me. That's it. It works. Yeah. They ate it. I want to. Sure. I want you to watch to like do a, a rollover of the video of, of like the. Um, the website and what they actually do, how they got started, like do a rundown of, of who they are with everything. But uh, the rundown of the camping. So uh, I always I wanted to, to, when I, you said you was worried about getting tied to a tree, squealing like a pig, handcuffs. Um, that's the only camping movie I ever saw. That's what happened. What, what, what was it? That was Ned Beatty. He had a rough situation in the woods. Just drop him, boy. <laughs> oh, I thought it was like uh, Burt Vernon Burt. goes to camp. No, uh, Burt Reynolds was in the movie <laughs> called Deliverance. I think Ooh. it was a camping movie. Deliverance. I think I heard that before. It's an interesting movie. It's a little, little rough in some sections. Yeah. Well, at least it's not that one cowboy movie with the sheeps. <laughs> But there wasn't sheep, it was cowboys and cowboys. What was that <laughs> called? Brokeback Mountain. Brokeback Mountain? There was no mountains and no brokebacks. Well, there's, there's a brokeback today. Not yes. pointing fingers. <laughs> oh, I see what you did there. Yeah, that's the worst. <laughs> that was a good good segue. That's, that's oh, I gotta put that, I had to put that clip in. Sorry you had to see that clip. But um, that's the worst part of camping is having to leave, but then getting home and having to put all that up. Because camping's over and you still got to <clears throat> think about it. Like, think about you still should be camping. But that's yes. a lot of work to put everything back up. Well, and yeah. And this it's heavy. Was, I'm, not, I'm not saying this was luxurious camping, but this is really nice camping. Brand has a lot of uh, camping gear and made it much easier to camp. But yes, you're talking now. The cast you get iron. Home, all that stuff. Yeah. It's got to go in different places. You don't have like a camping shed. No. You have. I, well, well, with Tasha having 50 jobs, I'm thinking she's buying an RV so we could just put everything in the RV and all we have to do is get food and we're go. Oh, nice. I'm thinking she got another job so we can buy an RV so we can just have everything in there. We don't have to get pulled everything out of the basement. We'll have it already in the RV ready to go. That's very, very generous. I know. Yep, Christmas. Is this like, is Christmas there, is there, is there, is there, is there, you thinking or? I don't know. Because Christmas is coming I'm up. usually pretty psychic. It's RV time. Yep, RV. But Santa, do you fit an RV down the chimney? Is that, no. is that something like you have to look outside? Your little thing like. It's kind of like an outside oven okay. chimney. Outside <laughs> oven chimney. But, uh, okay, The we, you, did you sleep any good? Did your back hurt because uh, you slept? Back is hurting because years, I've been in many uh, act like three auto accidents, uh, different types of things accumulated over life. And when it gets jacked, it gets jacked good. It's not like I'm always in pain all day long. Yeah. 
But I, I feel the that. ones that have the muscles, that when it has muscle spasms, it's just like you're talking, and you're just like, oh. yeah, he did and that. Then, and then you like when it goes away, you're back to talking. He did that earlier. That those are like, oh, they, you, you are awake. Put it that way. Yeah, I felt bad for him, and at the same time, I was trying not to forget what I was trying to say. <laughs> so that was probably selfish of me. No, no, it's all good. No, but I was it like... Don't, it don't get... Like, I, I, I did go look better. for medicine. It I always look, gets better. But I don't even take time. medicine except sleeping pills. Uh, yeah, I take... I try not to take medicine for this because you just... You build up a, after decades Tolerance. of... This is just... Yeah. Like, like how like you breathe or whatever, but... Um, um, I did not bring my pills because I didn't think it was going to be like this, but. Ooh. Yeah. Well, yeah. hopefully next camping trip, if, if he goes camping ever again, um, the, uh, what else? Uh, the cooking was probably kind of over the, um, it wasn't yeah. really over the top. We didn't cook a, a lot, I guess, cause it rained and we did lunch meat. But I think next time I'll dumb it down and just try to do hot dogs and hamburgers maybe instead of trying to cook. A big meal. The, it really, is, it wasn't hard to do. It's just harder because I was trying to record it. That's the hardest yeah, part, but, like I mean, trying you, to get this for you guys. You Your brought fault. a lot of stuff, like just buying the peppers and the onions, and I mean, which some stuff you would bring for hamburgers, but and not that you just have to live on hamburgers and hot dogs. But you, you made it really a uh, good experience. You went way above and beyond, which you sh I mean, you shouldn't have done that. that well, was, they they, uh, they did it. All the well, people that donated. Yeah, I appreciate all. All the people that donated, um, we really do loved hanging out. It was a great experience camping. If you've never been camping, um, you, you should give it a try. It really is like a honestly, it's like a reset on on life. Not it doesn't change how you think, but it, you just you kind of get grounded and you're not so stressed out of having to do a hundred things, take out the trash, do this, that, and the other thing. It's yeah. kind of like, hey, you want, you want to go for a walk around the campground? Sure. He was correct. If we went camping in this backyard and just ran an electrical cord out there, I would be doing 50 things. I oh, would yeah. Be, yeah. Just let I me mean, just do one, whoa, 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 one more thing. Whoa, 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 yeah. whoa, whoa got to do this. Yeah. Because no. that's what I do all day long. Um, but I, um, I would suggest if you go, if you want to go camping, suggest you can go out there or you can go online. This, this, this place has a good online deal, but you, um, you can reserve spots and stuff, but you can look for, look at the bathroom. The bathroom, like you want one with a shower. Uh, if you've never been camping before, you might want to go for it. Uh, one that has a dedicated shower and bathroom. Actually, a bathroom with a shower, uh, like one at uh, I want to say Wren Lake uh, Sandusky. There's a Sandusky North Sandusky, but we went there. Tasha and I went there the first time, and I'm glad they. It, it was opened up like that. She's opened up to doing the other ones with the shower houses without, with like, I guess there's four, four, five, well, this one had three. Some had four or five different showers in each one with the curtain and, and dividing deal. But there's some that has its own dedicated. So it's, it probably helped people out that don't, haven't camped like oh, ever like in an their life. You go in and individually shut the door. Yeah. It's just, just like that bathroom there has a bath. Okay. You know, yeah. It's bigger. There's room. Yeah. yeah but it's I mean, like half the size of here. Pretty nice. Where we were, I mean, I guess you could probably see someone else's head, like yeah. over the top of the. Well, shower. not mine, but <laughs> but like it had the you know like you go into a door it's shut, but it wasn't an individual like at home. That would be even nicer. But ours was ours was fine as long as you bring you know, remember to bring shower shoes or something. Yeah, shower shoes. It's Cro just, Crocs, Crocs, and it's not necessarily you're you're going to get athlete's foot, but. There's just a lot of stuff that gets carried in. You're in the middle of the woods. Well, I'm not an athlete, so I you bring it. you bring stuff in on your <laughs> on your shoes. So there's leaves and dirt yeah. accumulates. Yeah, and they probably don't scrub it like every day like that. I'm but, sure they're not. Yeah. they're not scrubbing like that. You just, but bring your soap and what you have. But it's um, it's you know, it's real relaxing. Also, I want to say like our bathrooms are always empty because we were around a lot of RVs and serious trailers that have their own shower and toilet inside their thing. So it's not like everyone had a tent, so those bathrooms were packed. Well, when I went camping with the AA camp out, there's a couple of them that didn't want to use their shower or the bathroom. They didn't want to dirt it up. They didn't want to do nothing with it, so they went to use it. Oh, they oh don't use my bathroom. Oh, somebody pooped in their bathroom. It was so bad. He was mad. Yeah, like, like that's what it's for. So if you have one, that's what it's for. It's convenience. It's the convenience yeah. of having one. Sure. 
But some do have a nice big shower in there, like big king size bed and the big RVs. I don't, actually, I don't want to, oh, older you get, the bigger RV you want, and then you can just, just not even have to worry about telling them, no, no, you're not coming. But right now, you don't want a big 30 person RV because everybody wants to go with you that you're trying to get rid of. Not rid of, ooh, ooh, cut, 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 trying to get away from for a little while. Yeah. Reset. 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 That's a good word. But you want to bring it because people that are scared to tent camp won't come. But if you got an RV, oh, that's a house. I'm, I'll go. I'll go now. Yeah. Yeah. Can so and so go too? So. But, uh, okay. We did the s'mores and I had it on my shirt. Had it on my, uh, yeah. I'm not a fan of the s'mores people. That you was, already know that. But, yeah. That, that's, it turned out okay. It tasted good. It's kind of like eating a peach. Like you're going to get messy or eating corn on the cob. Like you got to commit to like. But it sticks. It's like it's, yeah, it's I couldn't take it. Like after so much melted marshmallow, that is so sticky. We yeah. gave the marshmallows to the gentleman that had like two kids. I'm not sure if it was his younger brothers or his sons or whatever. But come to find out, I gave him a business card. I think he has two business cards now. Cause uh, he dropped a shoe from that car. He dropped a shoe at the bathroom <laughs> and the lot. And Bob had the bright idea of putting my business card in his shoe. So somebody's gonna find it. At least yeah. someone's gonna look at the shoe. So if he got the shoe back, then he ha he's gonna look like, oh, this is the ignorant guy that put the, his card in my shoe. I wonder what he put in the marshmallows. <laughs> That's what he's probably thinking. Yeah, yeah, I probably threw them away. But uh, no trick or treaters. We didn't get any trick or treaters out there. Um, we wasn't looking for any. Um, Actually, I don't. Even, I don't know that anybody came by. I don't think they. I don't even think they did that. He was decorated out there. I and decorated, yeah. So I, did he have anything in his trunk or was his trunk just open? I thought it was just open. You said he was trunk or treating. Why would you leave your trunk open like that? I don't know. Well, why would you leave a shoe in the middle? You know, he, he, uh, yeah, why would you leave? He's probably hoping somebody returns the shoe. Just throw it in the back of the trunk. It wasn't a croc, so he threw it away. If it was a croc, Brandon would have got it. Yeah. Now I have enough crocs. I got one croc I found fishing. You can use it as a floater. Like you can put a string on it and fish, probably. Probably. Like jugging. They call it jugging. Okay. Yeah, because they usually use jugs. And, but noodling. I call it noodling, but people get mad because noodling is when you shove your hand in the hole and you say it's a fish or a snapping turtle. It's not worth it for me. <laughs> they sell fish. Yeah, them options. Too. Yeah, options are. Yeah, those options, no. But I heard snakes, too. So. Not worth it. Okay. Well, we're going to take them to the airport. we got to get going. It is 932, so we're two minutes late. So we're going to get going here. We appreciate it, Bob, um, um, being here with your guys' help uh, donating. So we want to thank all you guys. We'll put it up at the end again. Did you want to say anything right before no, we go? I, want to say, I just want to say thank you. Not, not only to Brandon and Tasha for always being such wonderful hosts and going above and beyond this trip, but uh, it was obviously a huge part uh, due to you guys' uh, support. Um so thank you, and uh, hope you guys enjoyed the videos. We, I know we had fun making them, and hopefully uh, get together again soon to make some more. Okay, well guys, please share again. I'm gonna say if you want to see any more of Bob here or me there, please, please, please share the video so we can get the views up and we can do some more videos like this. Definitely helps. So, all right. Well, till next time. Thank you very much. See ya. I, I didn't know what to expect, but we are roughing it. Yeah, I told we pack. I'm packing. I, that's what I do. Oh, I, I need to get that from the table too. Uh, but uh, got to be protected. See?
I don't think we could get any more smoke coming. I don't understand this. Hey, thanks for watching the video again. If you haven't visited my website yet, um, the, the address is www.DougGarbageDisposalStore.com. You can navigate through the top, all these links right here. Um, there is actually a question and comment form. If you have any questions or comments, uh, fill that out, and it'll go straight to my email. At the very bottom, there is a free newsletter. Just sign up for right here, um, and you will get a weekly newsletter. So, uh if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting on? Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit see all so you get all the notifications and don't miss the videos. Please comment. I like to um, listen to your comments uh, and respond to you, so I do like to interact with you guys. Uh, please share the video with your friends, family, even your boss, and have a great day. Let's meet other plans.